I'm Dean Roberts. I'm the director of North American Near Infrared and Process Analytical Technologies. And I'd like to talk to you a little bit today about the use of the MPA system for pharmaceutical analysis. MPA stands for Multiple Purpose Analyzer. And as you can see with the instrument here, we have multiple measurement channels selectable under computer control on a single instrument. The transmission channel is meant for measuring liquids in either disposable vials or fixed path length cuvettes, which would be good for oils or other liquid samples that uh, you might be analyzing. We have an integrating sphere, which is useful for doing reflectance measurements on tablets or for doing reflectance measurements on powders, for raw material identification, for blend homogeneity analysis, granulation, drying applications, a multitude of applications for powders. You can also use the external transmission channel for doing tablet transmission for looking at content uniformity in pharmaceutical tablets. The 32 position auto sampler tray can be set up with a variety of custom diameter tablet holders for measuring the content uniformity in tablets by transmission or by reflection. Once the quantitative methods or conformity test methods have been established for a particular type of tablet, Analyzing the tablets in a manufacturing QA environment is very easy. You just fill in the auto sampler tables with the ID for each one of the tablets, fill the tablet holders that mask the beam so we don't get stray light surrounding the sample, and proceed with the measurement. Once the analytical methods have been defined for each type of tablet and dosage level, actual measurement in a quality control environment is quite easy. You simply add in the identity of each one of the tablets to be measured in a table in the Opus Lab software and initiate the measurement. A reference measurement is then acquired and subsequently each tablet is measured either by reflectance or transmission and the results are stored in the Opus database.